And we're going to go back to a time at the Masters where the old and the new worlds of snooker, the generations, if you like, collided. The old, represented by Steve Davis, and the brand new, represented by Ronnie O'Sullivan. In fact, this is the one and only time that these two legends of the game have met in the final of one of snooker's big three events. And the year was 1997. Currently ranked number 10 in the world, Steve Davis. My Masters trophy cabinet was a bit bare compared to my world and UK ones. Only two wins at Wembley, and the last one nearly 10 years before. Ronnie O'Sullivan. Ronnie, only 21, in his third consecutive final. He beat John Higgins in 1995. In 1996, he lost to the Wembley Wizard, Henry. Steve Davis and Ronnie O'Sullivan, both Londoners, of course. So it'll be interesting to see which way the crowd goes today. A good chance. I do really think it's important for Ronnie to get out to a good start today, not get bogged down by Steve's superior <coughs> tactical play. Just over three minutes so far. 50. Plus 50 break. Well, Steve Davis couldn't do a thing about that. So the young pretender. Ronnie O'Sullivan takes the opening frame. Back to back centuries. To open 102. This first session. Steve sitting there in admiration. Ronnie O'Sullivan got off to a flying start. Two quick fire centuries. It was brilliant. I needed to pull something out. Fortunately, a member of the crowd pulled something out, and Ronnie's and John Street's concentration was affected. calm and cool in the first two frames and then a little bit agitated. Well that was absolutely brilliant. Such a good rest player. Ronnie O'Sullivan. Why did he play that left handed? Frustration, maybe? It was a, just in the last, this last frame, it just seemed to me to have lost a little bit of his discipline. The session ended 4 all. In the evening, Ronnie went on an unbelievable run. 29. Well, how about that, Ronnie? Well, terrific. Nine. Four frames in 49 minutes. Had the nugget got anything left? Steve Davis is called the Nugget, the Ginger Magician. Mighty roar from this conference. 
Santa crowd. Fully deserved as an immaculate 130 break from Steve Davis. Takes him to within just one frame of 87. With the rocket misfiring, it started to become vintage play from me. A 1.30 break in the next, me, wow. But then all of a sudden, next frame, I had to dig deep. Well, again, producing the perfect shot. Absolutely sets the conference centre alight. Magnificent clearance there to level this match at eight frames off. £15,000. A mighty, mighty roar from the crowd. They're on their feet to applaud this credit to the game. One of the best ambassadors we've ever had. It took Ronnie a while to win his second Masters, ten years after his first, in fact. But he's still the Wembley wonder, matching Stephen Hendry's record of nine Masters finals. A third Masters title and the start of my world domination once again after being rudely interrupted by the upstart Hendry. Sadly, it remains my last major title. What a downer. It may 